Hello, and welcome to Error Genie. Today, I'll guide you through how to fix Dragon Age, the Veilguard black screen issue on PC. Follow these easy, step-by-step -step instructions to troubleshoot and get back to gaming. Step 1. Restart your computer. Start by restarting your computer. This simple step often resolves temporary issues. Step 2. Delete the shader cache file. Navigate to the game installation folder. For Steam games, right-click the game in your library, go to Manage, then Browse Local Files. In the Games folder, locate the Shader Cache folder. Make a backup of the Shader Cache folder by copying it to another location, then delete it from the original location. Relaunch the game to see if the issue is resolved. Step 3. Adjust Shader Cache Size in NVIDIA Control Panel. Right-click on your desktop and select NVIDIA Control Panel. Go to Manage 3D Settings, then Global Settings. Find shader cache size and set it to 10 gigabytes or 100 gigabytes. Click apply and restart your game. Step four, update BIOS. Go to your PC manufacturer's website, e.g. Dell, Lenovo, HP. Locate the latest BIOS update for your specific model, download and install it. Ensure your laptop is plugged in during the update. Step five, enable debug mode in NVIDIA control panel. In NVIDIA Control Panel, go to Help and check Debug Mode. Restart your game. Step 6. Allow the game through your antivirus. If using Windows Security, go to Settings, then Privacy and Security, then Windows Security, then Virus and Threat Protection, then Manage Ransomware Protection. Then allow an app through Controlled Folder Access. Add the game's executable file. Repeat this for any third-party antivirus software you may have installed. Step 7. Run as administrator right-click the game's executable file. Select Properties. Under the Compatibility tab, check Run this program as an administrator, then click Apply. Step 8. Perform a clean graphics driver installation. Visit the NVIDIA or AMD website, download the latest driver for your graphics card, run the installation and choose Custom Advanced. Check Perform a clean installation and continue. Step 9. Set DX11 or DX12 in launch options. In Steam, right-click the game, go to Properties, and type dash DX11 or dash DX12 under Launch Options. For EA, find Advanced Launch Options and add dash DX11 or dash DX12 as needed. Step 10. Verify or repair game files. For Steam, right-click the game, then Properties, then Local Files, then Verify Integrity of Game Files, for EA, select Repair in the game's Manage options. Step 11, update Windows and install Visual C++. Run Windows Update and check for updates. Install Visual C++ redistributables from Microsoft, link provided in video description. By following these steps, you should be able to troubleshoot the black screen issue. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more helpful guides here on Error Genie. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming.